Hello world and all who inhabit it, my name is Minish May and welcome back to more Explorers of Sky Randomizer. Oh, <laughs> in the last episode we found out more about the hidden land and now we're gonna head off to Brine Cave and see what we can un or unlearn, learn about the hidden land. Ahem. And so, as you're all quite well aware, Guildmaster has not yet returned from his errand. However, I intend to set off for Brine Cave is scheduled. Hey, hey, where'd Guildmaster go anyway? Um, I wouldn't know that. Is it going to be okay without the Guildmaster? No problem. There's no need for your concern at all. Guildmaster would have decided, must have decided that we can manage on our own without him for the time being. That's why he hasn't come home yet. Furthermore, in place of our absent Guildmaster, you have me to lead you. Uh, why isn't anyone saying anything? <laughs> it- it can't be! Do you think I'm not up to the task? It, everyone out with it! Am I perhaps- perhaps inadequate? Worthless to you? <laughs> it's so fun voicing him, I love it! Uh, nope. I wouldn't say that, by golly. When Guildmaster isn't here, it just feels less safe. Hey hey, you wouldn't- you know the Guildmaster, he's hard to figure out. But hey hey, he really comes through when things get rough. But the Guildmaster isn't with us right now, so we have to take charge and do as he wanted. That's right. I'm sure that we can get the job done on our own. Let's go for it, on our own. You're right, we can't count on the Guildmaster for everything. Oh yes, that's the spirit. Let's do our best. Chatot. The Guildmaster is absent, so there's only one among us who can lead. And that's you, Chatot. Huh? Wh who? Me? Of course. You said so earlier. You said we'll be fine because you're here to lead us. Lead the way. Show us, Chatot. That's right. Show us, Chatot. Hey, hey. Yup, yup. I'm counting on you. <laughs> well, everyone, y you can count on me when th things get bad. What's the matter, Chatot? Sound the call of duty already. I know. I know. Commencing now. We shall depart on a guild exploration of Brian Cave. Everyone, let's let us excel together. Hooray! All right, I think I have everything we need for Brian Cave. Let's head off. Now listen, everyone. This is the entrance to Brian Cave. Your objective is to reach the deepest part of this dungeon. That is where one will find the same odd pattern inscribed on the relic fragment that Pele has. However, it is there where an extremely vicious Pokemon lurks. I extremely vicious. Golly, that sounds scary. Gulp. Hey, hey, chat hot. What is it? Yesterday, Guildmaster said something about that vicious Pokemon. But chat hot, you seem to know just about. Eh, you just. <laughs> you seem to know just as much about this dungeon. Hey, hey. Chat hot, is it possible that you've been here before? That's right. I have come here before. I explored here a long time ago with the Guildmaster. It was deep in this cave that we saw that peculiar pattern. It was then, however, those tough Pokemon appeared. Ugh. S so what were they like? Tough, you say? Uh, I don't remember at all. Huh? You don't remember? Yes, but I'm loath to admit it. They attacked us with no warning out of nowhere. I was knocked out before I could do a thing. When I came to, the Guildmaster was tending to my wounds. But I have no memory of the events before that, so I couldn't tell you what the attackers were like. Ugh. That gives us nothing to go on. So, we don't know what kind of enemy we're facing. We'll have to make our way slowly. Wait a second. Hey, Chatot. At first you said there was a vicious Pokemon, but then you said they attacked you. There's more than one? Pele, that's not very inclusive of you. <laughs> no, it was just one. There was one extremely vicious Pokemon, but it wasn't alone. When they attacked- Oh, I remember now. They attacked all at once. I recall getting slammed with water, like a tidal wave. Like a tidal wave? That couldn't mean water type- that could move- bleh, water type moves! We're a ground type. We don't like water at all. I hope we don't have to fight enemies like that. It would be awfully dangerous to make a go of it alone! That's right. We should make several groups to explore the cave. We'll do that, sir. Yup, yup. Hey, hey, we should form teams that don't bunch up types. You two, remember what the guildmaster said yesterday. The two members from Team Slugbug must be in my group. Therefore, you two shall accompany me while I'm exploring this cave. Understood? I trust you won't hold me up too much. 
Oh, you must not expect me to do everything for you. Oh, I stopped using his voice. Oops. It's up to you to look after yourselves. Ugh, understood. All right, everyone. We're off to conquer Brine Cave. Let's give it our all. Hooray! Yes, let's head off. Oh, God, I'm scared. <laughs> Chief, looks like those louts from the guild are already inside. Ho oh, ho, should we follow them? Ha <laughs> ha sounds good. We'll track them, but let's keep out of sight. When the right time comes along somewhere in the cave, that's when we'll grab that wimpy Pele's relic fragment. Then we'll hightail it to the deepest part of the cave. We'll grab all the glory of solving this mystery. Ha <laughs> ha, brilliant, Chief. Your plan's perfect. Ha ha ha, naturally. Anyway, it will be us, Team Skull. We'll be the ones to going to the hidden land. <laughs> I hate their fucking laughs. Why do they have to laugh all the time? Oh, Fortune Ravine music. Oh, it's a fucking forest. Okay. Oh, there's the stair sensor. All right, this is gonna be really nice because I kind of oh, I kind of just want to get to the end, like ASAP. Like oh, chat hot, please, 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 dude. Oh my god, we're already off to a wonderful start. Um, please go down. Okay. Alright, this is- this is going fantastic. Alright, that stair sensor is gonna be great. Golden seed! Excuse me! Wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute, hang on, I, I'm gonna use my ginseng right now. Uh, payday? Nom nom nom. Okay, wait a- fucking golden seed? Doesn't that give you, uh... Oh, oh, okay, okay. I thought that that gave you health, but uh, golden seed, that's kind of sexy. Not gonna lie. Um, probably won't use it. Probably save them for Mimi if we do want to keep her on the team. But golden seeds, those are nice. But if anything exciting happens, I'll be sure to keep you guys up to date. We're gonna. Head through, and I'll see you guys when something exciting happens, as per usual. Huh? No! Fuck off. Fuck off! No, stop! Chat hot! Stop with the fucking mischievous! Come on, really? Stop! Chat hot, please, you can't use these reviver seeds. You said you didn't want us holding you back, you're the one holding us back. Holy fuck. <laughs> Those Pokemon are scary. We need to get to the end of this dungeon right now. Like, we need to get done yesterday. <laughs> oh my god. Ah. Oh, don't do that. Nah, nah. Uh-uh, Draco Meteor. Bye bye. Are all of your moves turned on? Okay, cool. Golden seed? Alright, the stairs are up that way. Life seed! That's what I was looking for, baby. Alright, Miel's gonna eat that. <laughs> Woo! 87, baby! Oh my god, I hope there's more uh, life seeds in this dungeon that we can find. Oh man, thank you, Brian Cave. This is exactly what I needed for the final boss. Uh oh! Uh oh! Oh! Chat hot! Holy fuck! Alright, goodbye, goodbye. Good night. Sleep well. It's Flaffy, please! Please, Flaffy, no! No! All my reviver seeds. Down the Dwayne! Fuck off, Flaffy. For real. <laughs> no! I only have two left. That's upsetting. I should have just went right to the stairs. Take it from me! Fucking don't be stupid! Oh, we made it to the end. Oh, I love the music. As usual. We've gone pretty far down. Hey, Chat Hot, are we nearing the place where you saw that pattern? We're nearly there. We don't have far to go. However, as I told you before, every step also takes us closer to those vicious Pokémon. Yes, we'll have to stay careful and keep our eyes open. 
Anyway, we don't have far to go now. Let's keep it up, Miel. Ow! Oops, excuse me. Hey! Whoa, long time, weaknings. Weaknings? Oh, you're that nice, team, eh? This is it, the relic fragment. That's... <laughs> I'll take this. Hey! Whoa, this is the second time you're getting mugged for this. You don't learn very well, that's for sure. W wait, wait, please! I'm afraid I'm not following what's going on here. Why are you even here? We haven't seen any of you- We haven't seen any of you from Team Skull since you suddenly disappeared during the expedition. I fretted for your well-being. Worried, huh? Cha-ha-ha! <laughs> your guild's full of gullible nincompoops just waiting to be fleeced. Oh? Your demeanor and language seem to be much coarser now. Chatot, they were deceiving the guild all this time. They're a bad exploration team. Team Skull is a bunch of crooks. Wh what Is that true? <laughs> what else? You'd have to be naive beyond belief to be fooled for this long. Hey. <laughs> hey, hey, is he suddenly corfish? Anyway, now that we've got the relic fragment, now we just have to get to the hidden land. Eat your heart out, nitwits. Cha <laughs> ha. Squawk! Squawk! Those stinking scoundrels! Play me for a fool, will they? Squawk! They won't get away with this! I'll show them what it means to trifle with me! Hey, wait, Chatot! He's gone. Chatot was sure furious. I hope he'll be okay. After all, there were those vicious Pokemon he'd warned us about lurking ahead. Not just that, we still need to recover my relic fragment from Skuntank. We should hurry too. Indeed, we must get it back. Cause those fuckers cannot take the glory of saving the fucking world. And we know damn well that they wouldn't even save the world. Ooh, crystal, ooh, it looks like a fucking like relic, what the hell? Hi, Blossom. Slammed. Nice. Dude, fucking, how did we use two Reviver Seeds already? I'm really sad. I'm sure we'll be able to cheese the fucking final boss, but we'll see. I'm scared. <laughs> uh, where's the fucking stairs? Oh, hi, Blake. Ah! <laughs> really? Oh! Bye-bye. Um, wait, oh, what happened to my, my, oh, I didn't ever set it, I guess. What? What? Okay, alright, no fucking around anymore. Ooh, no, 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 no. Okay, I keep fucking up, I get it! No! Come on, that's not fucking fair. You know what? I'm just gonna roll with it. Just gonna roll with the punches. Just gonna... Everything... Everything's fine. I'm not losing my mind. Four reviver seeds. And we're only down to one. I'll see you guys at the end of the dungeon. Oh, fuck off, coughing. Where's your leader? Where's your fucking leader? You're nothing without your leader. Here's the fucking Team Skull battle we were hoping for. You're going down, motherfucker. Fucking destroyed. You know, if I were monetizing my videos, I would be cancelled right about now. Oh, aw, fuck off. Damn it. I was about to get really excited. No. Oh my god, we gotta get to the stairs right now. Come on, with the fucking seeds and shit. Oh, no. 21! Oh, come on. Fuck off. Alright. Everything's fine. Where's the fucking stairs? Come on. Oh, no. Oh my god. Fuck off! Oh my god, we're so fucking dead. Wait, oh my god, no. No! No. <laughs> oh, fuck off. Okay, wait. I'm gonna do the only plausible thing. 
and reset. <laughs> oh, fuck off. Oh, what the fuck? That's such a weird layout. Okay, so I reset because I'm a cheater and I still have my two reviver seeds and I'm not gonna let Electrike fuck with us anymore. Haha, <laughs> that was the funny number. Sleep well, Snubble. <gasps> Ooh, well we already have a Lunar Ribbon so it's not like we really need it, I guess. I'll take that though. Nom nom. That's such a weird layout, what the hell? Okay, all right, I can, I can deal with this. Roar of time, bitches! What? Okay, oh no, all right. Getting Roar of Time was a bad mistake. What? Come on, Pele, you can take that. I'm going to inhale the gummy. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. I'm losing my mind at 3 a.m., guys. Oh, that hurt. I'm so fucking over it. Okay. Alright, let's get through fucking Brian Cave, please. Uh, me, me like 20 minutes ago. I love this game, it's so great! Me now, I'm fucking... I wanna die. Alright, let's go. Oh my god! Hi! How's it going? Oh my god! Fucking kick its ass! What are you doing? Use Thundershock! Oh my god. I gotta do everything my fucking self, don't want I, buddy. Kick its ass. I'll help you out. Nice. Wait! No! Come on, dude! Why wouldn't you attack the whale lord? There you go. Oh, that's so much experience. Oh, fuck off. No, you're going right the fuck to sleep. Good night. All right. Roar of time, roar of time. Sleep night, sleep night night. Holy shit. There's two drawbacks to my favorite moves. Roar of time has you pause and Draco Meteor lowers your special attack. It's great. It's fantastic. Come on. Really now. Oh ho ho. You're going down. 69, funny number. Night night. No, no sleepy time. No memento. No singing. I can't fall asleep, you bastard. I inhale green gummy, but I'm not making that noise again. And I want red gummy. Pele, you can have this. Because, you know, dis despite you not knowing fucking proper- We never speak of this again. <laughs> I love how it goes right to the end. Well. We've descended quite a ways, but we haven't caught up to Chat Totter Team Skull yet. This place, it's horribly hot and humid here, but don't you like when shit's hot? Ugh. Hey, I heard a voice over there. Let's go, Miel. Wow, it's Team Skull! Erg. W what happened to you guys? Oh, no way! Were you attacked by a mysterious gang of enemies? Oh, you knew it was coming. Would have been good to know that. Not that you'd tell us. <laughs> Skuntank, are you alright? <laughs> you find us at your mercy. And you're worried how we are? How sickeningly generous can you nitwits be? We're not about to walk away from anyone if they're hurt. <laughs> your concern's wasted on us. We'll be fine. You po that pompous chat hot. He riled me off enough to keep me going. Huh? Chatot did what? Here's what he did. That Chatot came along after we got wiped out. When he spotted us down and out, he scolded us with all sorts of choice words. 
After giving us that blistering tongue lashing, he went on his way. The things he said about us. I'm still seeing red. I'm s I am so steaming mad that I refuse to give up here. I'm getting out of here if I have to crawl so I can deliver my payback to that blasted chatot. But if you think about it, we were close to giving up when that chatot saved us by riling us up. <laughs> but even though you say you've been saved, you look like you're still in a lot of pain. <laughs> We've been bad to you all this time. You went through downright rotten times because of us. But you two still can still bring yourselves to worry about us like this? Yes, you did make us furious over this and that. But when we see you down and out like this, we can't just walk away. <laughs> hey, the relic fragment! <laughs> Oops, how unlike me. That relic fragment slipped out of my grip. And I can't move yet. That Pele is going to steal it back. <laughs> Skuntank, I only dropped the relic fragment by accident. You're free to pick it up. Or not. Skuntank, thank you. <laughs> Why thank me? The next time we meet, we're going to be back to our old tricks of messing with you. Besides, don't waste your time worrying about us. You need to be worrying about Chatot instead. That's right! Where did Chatot go? He went deeper. He's going after those enemies. You two hurry up and go too. Thanks, Skuntank. We're going in deeper after them. Skuntank, be sure to get your team out. Don't give up. <laughs> I'll ask you not to patronize Team Skull. <laughs> we have to go, Miel. You two. Can you move? Oh, you can't be serious. The way they trounced us. I'm just too wiped out. So that's it. Well, we must really look like a mess. <laughs> but Chief... I like how you kept yourself until the very end. That you're a little bit of a good guy. You redeemed yourself. Shut it. <laughs> but I gotta say, Chief, there's something to be said about you doing that. <laughs> Shut up. Hey, Chatot! Hmm, <laughs> you two. Be alert. They're very close by. I saw their retreating figures when I gave chase. But I'd lost sight of them by the time I reached this spot. They must be lurking here somewhere. But there doesn't appear to be any place to hide here. What is this? An odd sense of foreboding. There are only these rock walls around us. That one glance I caught of them, I'm on the verge of remembering. That's it! When they attacked me last time, they seemed to appear out of nowhere. But where they really appeared from was... Miel, be careful! They're above us! What? What? I am Kabutops. And the Amistar brothers. All trespassers need to be taught a lesson. Take that! Erg. Ch Chatot! What? Ugh. I won't let you get away with this. How do you like that? The hero shielded his buddies with his body. That's not what I'd call smart. Hey, I remember. Kabutops. That big hero's been here before. We knocked him out the same way, too. This isn't the second time he's done that. That really takes a whole lot of smarts. Haha. <laughs> Say what you will. They're our prized recruits. I won't let you harm them. Chatot. Erg. Chatot! Ha <laughs> ha It's your turn next. Take this! No, you take this. Dark Void, baby! They just see a fucking Weedle go... Dark Void! <laughs> Guess what, bitches? It's time to end this. I love it. I fucking love it. Oh, look at that! Oh my god, I love it! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Pele! Pele! Oh my god. Oh! Okay, wait. All right. I'm not fucking around. Roll play? No, none of that right now. I don't need the money. I just want Kabutops dead. Just want big boy dead. There we go. Nice. Eep. Erf. Aye! <laughs> Chatot! Urf. 
Chatot, are you all right? Stay with us! Chatot! That voice. Guildmaster. Wigglytuff. And Grovile, too. Guildmaster! Wah! Grovile! What is Grovile doing with the Guildmaster? I'll explain later. This is more important. Chatot! Hey, hey, this is bad! Chatot is down! Golly, he's hurt! Chatot, are you okay? Are you hurt? Haha, <laughs> I'm fine. I'm hale and hearty, as you can see. Chatot, I'm sorry, Chatot. If I only got here earlier. Please, don't blame yourself, Guildmaster. But, this is so humiliating to be knocked out this by the same enemies. Again! That isn't true, Chatot. The last time we came here, you were knocked out right away, Chatot. So you probably don't remember this, but... That time, when Kabutop's gang sprang out at us, you shielded me from attacks, Chatot. Excuse me? I sent Kabutop's gang packing right after that, but if it weren't for you jumping out to shield me, Chatot, I would have been knocked out on the spot. I owe my life to Chatot. That's what happened? Chatot, you are my invaluable partner. I, I am privileged to hear such words, Guildmaster. I am such a happy Pokemon. Whoa, Chatot! Chatot! Everyone, stay calm. Yes, he'll live. He still has time. Get him back to the guild now. Well then, quick, let's all go back to the guild. No, we'll take Chatot back to the guild. But as for you, Miel and Pele, and you, Grovile, you three must keep going. But don't worry about it. Besides, if you don't go on from here, Chatot shielding you would have been for nothing. Ugh. The strange pattern is up ahead. Now hurry. Thanks, Wigglytuff. We will continue onward. Let's go, Pele. Miel. Okay. Let's go, Miel. Don't give up, Chatot. We love you! Even though you're a dick. Good luck. Find the hidden land. Grovile, how did you know to join us here? Wigglytuff brought me. What? Wigglytuff did? That's right. Wigglytuff had been looking for me. As soon as he found me, he asked me to go with him. He said you were close to finding the hidden land. It worked out fine, because I planned to join you anyway. Plan to join us? Wait, does that mean- That's right. I've collected all the necessary time gears. Yes! All we have to do now is get to the hidden land! So let's find that place with a strange pattern now! Wow! There's water here! Hold on. This is seawater. Look at that, Miel! It's so pretty. The cave's mouth opens wide to the sea. We couldn't see it from outside because it's in the shadows. It's true. The sea is visible beyond the rock walls. It's nearly evening. We didn't notice the time go by. The tide rises up to here from the gap in the walls. Oh, that's... What? Miel, what's wrong? Hey! Look at this! Th this is the same as the pattern on my relic fragment. I guess this is the same pattern that Chatot described. Let me bring out my relic fragment. Hey! The relic fragment! Whoa! The pattern on the wall is glowing now? It's as if it's reacting to the relic fragment. Wah! What? What was that? A beam of light shot out to the sea. What's that out there? What? That's... It's coming closer. It's swimming. Pele, Miel, and Grovile, correct? You know our names? Yes. I was informed by Wigglytuff. W Wigglytuff told you? That pattern on the wall shot out a beam of light across the sea. You appeared right after that. Can you tell me who you are? I'm Lapras. I am the guide to the Hidden Land. You're what? You can take us to the Hidden Land? You unleash the beam of light from the pattern on the wall. That is the signal for gaining entry to the Hidden Land. It is beyond the sea. Step onto my back. I will carry you across the sea. Don't be afraid. I'm exceptional. 
I can carry all of you and more on my back. It's beyond the sea. The hidden land. Miel. Pele. Let's go. Beyond the sea. Alright, guys. I think that's about it. In the next episode, we'll go to the hidden land. I'll see you guys then.